it's a good question. Why this? Why this? Why yeah. this little bit of information in the midst of, and literally the craziest part is, where does it go from there? After Jesus was kind of pulled into line by his mother, what does it say? He, he goes back to Nazareth and lives with them yeah. obediently. That's all I mean, it says. Like, so there you, you own in on this weird little event, and then for the next 20, what, well, 18 whatever years. Nothing. Yeah, like, okay, well, you can't ignore that. You can't at least, at least, you've got to stop and say, what was the author trying to do yet? It's not like right. Jesus didn't do stuff every day after that. Why is he thinking 18 years of his life is not worth mentioning, but not this a single thing detail. is? Yeah. Not a single detail. Uh, and, and so, you know, you're coming to this as the Gentile, you're like, this is the miracle worker. This is the guy who makes the sun come up in the morning. You're telling me that between 12 and 30, he did nothing? Hmm. He, he performed no miracles. He never waved his hand and water stopped. The waterfall stopped or something like that. We can't, we can't find out any of that information, but we have to know that he was sitting in the temple at 12 asking questions. Okay. Effectively, your training as the rabbi officially would start around that age, and it would end when you're 30, because then you became the rabbi. What we're getting told basically is Jesus didn't have formal training at the most critical time that he needed formal training. Once Jesus becomes a rabbi, there's hints in the Gospels, because what does it say? Isn't this Jesus the son of Joseph? You know what that's like saying? Yeah, that's isn't it's this Grant and, Yeah, isn't this Grant and Chase, the, the book editors? What are they doing in the synagogue trying to talk? So that, or, or and then and then in John's gospel, right? The Pharisees say, "How did this man get such knowledge when he's never been to school?" There we so go. So they had, they clearly were saying, "We've never trained him." He was taught Torah by the same Spirit who raised him from the dead and who empowers us and who gives us the hope of our life in Jesus. And he says, "As I, he doesn't say the Spirit, but he pretty much says as much." Elsewhere in John, they say they ask him that question, and he says, "My teaching is not my own; it comes from Him who sent me." Right. So it's he look he did he, whatever he, he learned he learned it from from the Father must yeah. have been and, and by the power of the Spirit.